This is Magical Dinosaur Tour, essentially an interactive CD dino encyclopedia. See? CD technology can be used for more than just explosions, weapons, blood and guts. <laughs> A shame? Yeah, kinda. The back of the box lays it all out in one paragraph. <clears throat> You're exploring a primeval forest over 100 million years ago. Suddenly, the mighty Tyrannosaurus appears. With the push of a button, you bring him to life. Wait, 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 wait. Why would you want to bring a Tyrannosaurus to life? And wait a minute, if he's appearing, he's already alive. So the... you... the... Oh, you know what? Forget it. Sort through hundreds of the mighty beasts, and see what may have led to their ultimate extinction. <sighs> yeah, you know what it reminds me of? Something you would find at, like, a museum kiosk. <laughs> but, is that interesting enough to hold your attention? Hmm. Hi, my name is Lolo. Lolo is a dinosaur, your friendly talking baby tour guide. Now, first of all, how is she talking? And second of all, how did she get this job at such a young age? Lolo pretty much pops up here and there, explaining how the handful of different modes work, which can all be selected at one giant main hub. The Guidance Mode is essentially a training segment which describes navigational functions. Page turning mode automatically leafs through the encyclopedia one page at a time like reading from a book. Variety box mode shows you fun random dino facts. Ending mode depicts the mysterious extinction of the dinosaurs. Tree of evolution mode shows the progress of evolution. And name index mode allows you to retrieve information on individual dinos via a fast search. Now the Magical Dinosaur Tour mode is obviously the main attraction. You select a specific time period and region, which then shows you panoramic scenes of each area. Then you can choose a dinosaur, where some are given a nice write-up and photos, or an audio commentary describing the strengths, weaknesses, and personalities. One of the first lizards on Earth, it was able to glide through the air. Others even have neat little animations to support their stories. And that's it. <laughs> the name of the game describes it perfectly. It's a tour of dinosaurs. Around 160 dinosaurs are recreated, so there's quite a bit here. The script was written by a science office and pulled from a ton of historical information, so it's quite legit. But that's it. How do you rate the graphics? Well, there are a ton of still photographs, which are rather grainy, but don't look horrible. There are also some nice little animations popping up here and there. I would say visually, the game looks fine for a museum kiosk piece. <laughs> the sound isn't bad. There is so much speech packed into this disc that the clips are heavily compressed, much like that of J.B. Harold Murder Club. Triceratops is believed to be the deadliest of the herbivores. Unlike J.B. Harold, though, you cannot turn off the speech this time, so eh, you're out of luck whether you like it or not. Most of the music sounds processor-based, so it's average. The control. Well, it's mostly a bunch of menus, so you select, you click, and that's it. Magical Dinosaur Tour is a good game, well, it's not really a game, but if taken in the right context, it isn't bad. Maybe they should have made it slightly a game. I mean, I would have liked some dinosaur games or something like that, which would have allowed for more interactivity. Ooh, simulated battles. Yeah, a fight to the death. Now that would have ruled. <laughs> but. This CD is a straight-up, educational, family program.
Magical Dinosaur Tour is tough to rate because it's not a fast action shoot 'em up or a nail biting role player. I mean, it's it's barely a game. But honestly, if you are interested in dinosaurs in the least, I think it does the job well and has a lot inside. So I'm rounding up to an average three out of five. I can't recommend it necessarily, so I will leave it up to you to decide whether you find this game disappointing or somewhat magical.